let's let's slow it down Ooh, i need a sip to that girl but I miss won't you listen? Brown sugar, babe. I guess high off your love. I don't know how to be here. What's up guys and welcome back to another video on my channel. My name is Trinity Tannis. I like to just spill some facts and spill some tea on my channel about certain topics. Now I used to have the brand Trinity and usually talk about like gossip or but I kind of want to rebrand my whole Trinity segment into more of like a self-care, more of like a guidance kind of thing. So stay tuned for a bunch of Trinity videos, a bunch of self-care videos and of course can't forget about the tea. So grab you a nice cup of tea, rewind, get comfy, and just enjoy the video. So as you guys can see by the title, this is going to be a video kind of like my experience and something that's just been going around my mind a lot, something that I've just been constantly thinking about. I'm currently 19 years old. I don't turn 20 until September 6, 2022. Now, a lot of the times I'm usually very happy and very excited for my birthday and turning into another milestone age. The idea of turning 20 to me has kind of just been kind of overwhelming. So I'm going to talk a little bit about that in this video. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more Trinity videos, more self-care videos. And yeah, let's just get right into the video. Can't tell if I'm either happy or very scared and i know if any older heads are like watching i know you're probably like 20 girl you got so many years ahead of your life girl this is barely anything i always hear about the 20s being your prime year the 20s is the year that you live for the 20s is just everything and more i guess what i'm scared about one thing is the ideas that my 20s are supposed to be like my prime years and like the years that i have like the most fun and find like the you know greatest friends and everything I'm the kind of person who I, the way that I'm thinking about my life to go is I want to work, 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 and then relax later on, especially since the pandemic hit and I've been doing a lot of online and at home stuff. I have not been social with anyone, like at all. When I see 20 year olds and I see them with like their big group of friends and they're in the, they have their college friends and everything. I'm scared that I am not going to live that at all. I'm currently a full-time student in college. Let's sip tea to that, child. I have been taking all my courses online. I don't talk to people and I'm not social. Where do the friends come in? Where do the groups come in? See that the 20s is like the years where you can mess up, you know, don't have to stress about it too much because you don't really have such huge responsibilities that other people may have. That scares me because I'm the kind of person like when I mess up at something, to me, it's like everything is ruined. I'm very cautious about so many things. Already planning for failure if something bad goes wrong. I'm supposed to be rich at this age and I'm supposed to be successful at this age. And if I'm not, that means I'm failing. So especially when I look on social media and I look at a lot of media platforms and I see a bunch of young successful period, I get very kind of like I get imposter syndrome. I kind of just feel like, oh, I can never reach that um, goal. I would never reach this at 21, 22 years old, it's not gonna happen. I'm kind of looking back at my mindset when I was 18 and when I hit 20 years old, yeah, I'm gonna be successful. I'm gonna be so financially ready. Like, girl, you turn 20 in a couple of months. Unless you hit that jackpot, you ain't getting rich nowhere. I'm trying to get rid of that mindset before I hit 20 that, okay, you know, it's 20, you didn't, you didn't reach the goal that you wanted, but it doesn't mean you automatically fail overwhelms me is when I get online and I see so many people like you are 20 years old you need to be investing now I just started learning how to make doctor appointments for myself without my mom's help let's let's slow it down you just start to kind of 
be value yourself like i know i've seen a bunch of like older people talking about this how this generation is kind of moving too fast you know everybody wants to like now have their own business by the age of 18 and get married by the age of 25 and have kids but you know like everyone is just moving so fast in this generation getting their dream car having two um businesses and you got a whole luxury apartment at 20 years old snaps and claps to all the boss young successful people but i feel like a lot of times now the ones who aren't at that stage they just start to feel like oh i'm nothing in life i just feel like i'm not prepared to enjoy my 20s I'm just gonna be abusing myself and mentally and physically to reach certain goals that i don't have to reach because i just feel like i'm not where i want to be i'm only turning 20 i've only lived for two decades i have so much time to make mistakes so much time to figure out what i want to do i constantly feel like i always know 24 7 what i want to do and i'm always like so strict on it girl i have changed my career and changed i have changed what i want to have as my career change what i want in the future and change what i want to do so many times i want my 20s to just be a very soft life and just a life where i can figure out what i want to do figure out where i'm planning to go make my mistakes and not have to be so cautious all the time about getting to one point you get what i'm saying everybody wants to make it at a super young age no nope. and i get that but i feel like a lot of us who are about to turn into our 20s we are pushing ourselves too hard and we are living we are creating unrealistic um ideas sometimes that we feel so distraught and feel so damaged and broken where we don't reach our goals when this is our time where we're able to make our mistakes and reach different goals and reach different plaques Ooh, i need a sip to that girl but if you are someone who is turning 20 if you, even if you're someone who just turned 20 you know and you're just confused on how you want to live your 20s i hope you know that this is the year for you to be able to make your mistakes this is the year to push yourself but don't abuse yourself figure out who you are and figure out what you want to do and just live a soft life just enjoy it you get what i'm saying just enjoy it. don't follow everything on the media who i'm wishing a soft life soft 20s to all the girls okay hope you guys enjoyed this video i really hope you guys drunk your tea and you feel relaxed and if you are older than your 20s or if you're almost out of your 20s leave some tips for all the um early 20s and just turning 20 girls in the comments love you guys so much stay tuned for my next one bye